Hey folks, uh, we are up today in the mountains of Vermont in an undisclosed stream. We did bring metal detectors today, but I probably won't be using them too much because today we are looking for gold in the stream. Our friend Scott, who we've seen on the channel a few times, is down there already digging and we're accompanied by a couple more guys, uh, Rick and Justin, who maybe we'll meet more later. An exciting day for us because we haven't been gold panning together. It's been before we were into metal detecting. Six, seven years, something like that? Something like that, yeah. And uh, we weren't very successful before, <laughs> but hopefully we will be today. As you can see, the guys down in there are uh, waist deep in a hole they've been digging. I'm excited. You excited? Pumped, man. Right, let's go see if we can find some gold. Find some gold. So how long have you guys been digging this hole? A few weeks, anyway. Oh, only yeah. a few weeks? Yeah. We started last year. We were actually down beyond that other rock that's poking out. Yeah. Not the one Eddie's on, but the next one down. Okay. We, we started down there and have been working this way. I've got 11 grams from from down below where Eddie is yeah. up to this point. Wow. Excellent. I'm early it's at not three. That heavy, it's just I don't dig as much as these guys. Yeah. They're a little younger. <laughs> They're a little younger than me. I'm at somewhere around four or four and a half, but I haven't dug this hole. It's gotcha. Today. So we're we're doing pretty well, I would say, so far for the season. I would say. You got more than us. Enough for bottles and all that stuff. Yeah. Okay. Is it bad luck getting it out too early? No, I just wanted to make sure you had what you needed. So I kind of went off on my own out of uh, the big pit that they're digging and I found what I thought was a garnet. So I asked Justin here if he ever finds garnets up here and he showed me something that's crazy. I think it's crazy. That's beautiful. It glows, you, you said you called them a uh, blood garnet? Blood stones or blood garnets, I believe yeah. is what they talk about, Vermont. The thing that uh, is blowing my mind is like all of the facets in it. It looks like a, you know, what you think of when you think of like a crystal. Mm -hmm. That's so cool. Look at this, Eddie. A garnet. Oh my gosh. Isn't that crazy? Holy cow, that's awesome. So I've got, um, like I said, I kind of went off on my own over here and started digging into the bank. And I just got, I got two little flex maybe you can see up at the right at the seam is it right nope to your right oh oh there's right one Jeez. Yeah. i don't know if you folks can see that but there's another one in that black sand too but i spotted this garnet i i didn't know it was garnet it just looked like a red rock you see it it's like a flake yeah and it, you know i got excited and <laughs> when we went down a garnet wormhole that's so cool so anyway i i have been uh striking out until now with gold and you have one micron like that so size, far, right? yeah. I'm still going through the current pan, but cool. One micron. I didn't know we should be looking for garnets, so I, you know. Yeah. Now I'm going to keep my eyes I open. I could have thrown away. I could have thrown away tons of garnets. Hand, you know, a fist size one. Oh my gosh. I'm having fun. We're not finding a whole lot of gold right now, but it's still. I mean, I'm getting excited. So excited. E even over like nothing. <laughs> Just like that looks like a good shovel full. Of yeah. Yeah, it does. Okay, okay. <laughs> so while I was digging up in the bank up by myself up there, uh, Rick was in the hole, and you said that this came from uh, one bucket? Half a bucket. Half a bucket. I was super excited about my two little microns. I think I'd probably pass out if I found that. <laughs> They're on it right now. <laughs> Get your pants. All right. Okay. I'll let them fill their pans first. All right, well, this is my first pan since... Rick found uh, more gold than I've ever seen in my entire life in one pan. <laughs> I've got high hopes. <laughs> right. There, you see that? Maybe, maybe not. It's small, but I'm still excited about it. So you filled up a five gallon pail with uh, classified 
this material. And this was at the bottom? Yep, this was just like the half, last half a pan worth in the bottom. That's awesome. And in your experience, that's a good pan? Yeah, you can find that all day long. You're doing good. Very good. All right, well, Scott's giving away dirt, so I'm gonna go grab some. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's in a... That looks like pretty decent stuff. Eddie just came running up the bank. Holy smokes, dude. <laughs> that, uh, that's incredible. I know, I can't believe this. Good for you, buddy. I guess yeah, I should go finish my pan. Awesome. I ran up here because it's starting to sprinkle and I want to put my camera away, that's but. A, that's... Would you say that with some micro there or a small yeah, flake, that little a, one on the end? You can call it whatever you want. It's a little bit want. bigger than a micro. Wow. That's five decent pieces right there. Good for you, one buddy. Pan. That's not even <laughs> half a bucket. The horse flies are worth it. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so Eddie just got done showing us his monster pan. You immediately returned to your pan. And I went back to mine. And I just hear a <laughs> I went, woohoo! I gotta garn it. I actually haven't really finished the pan for gold yet. I'm trying to find my seat. And uh it's not huge, but I got a garnet a little one and it's got it's got facets which is what i think is the most amazing part about these and i brought my flashlight over hi i'm getting excited about garnets <laughs> and i'm gonna put it on my flashlight hey ben man oh you just lost it oh you no lost i lost it, it. <laughs> oh my god you can't believe it i can't believe i just dropped my garnet all right i gotta find it again All right, well, it's gone. I lost it. I know. It was just, it was my first. Gone. Well, it's raining now. I'm stuck up under this ledge. Try to keep the camera dry. Really <laughs> pouring hard. That's all right, we were already wet. Well, we've got thunder and lightning, so we don't know how much longer we're going to stay. It was just getting exciting, too. Lost my garnet and wasn't able to find another one. So I felt bad. Scott and Justin were in here giving us scoops. So I wanted to get in and get some scoops for myself. And uh, I've had about four shovelfuls here and I bring it out and there's absolutely nothing on the shovel. And it's freezing in here. So I wanna say thanks again, guys. Look, it happened again. <laughs> I wanna say thanks again, guys, for doing this for us all day. A couple of beginners. It's different when you're down that deep. It's so different. Ah, oh, I got some. <laughs> There's one. Yeah, for you. No, I I was almost gonna just dump this out because I didn't think I got any good soft sand or whatever. I don't know the terminology. I haven't actually made it into here yet, but I just got that. Ooh. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, I can see it from here. Yeah. Look at that. Two. Yeah. I guess I did all right. Oh, yeah. That was just nice. for from one one uh, classified pan too. Yeah. That's and great. uh. I think the water came up. Just, really? The water did. Come water up. came up. Uh, I lost my lens cap from my camera, but I found two little pieces of gold. Good train. What you got, buddy? My first confirmed little garnet. Look at that. That's better than mine, I think. The one I lost. Is that the one I lost? 
<laughs> you know, and before Justin found his today, I feel like I've thrown away a ton of these Maybe. like looking ones. Like, yeah, what is that? Oh well. Oh my gosh, but I'm all I'm super pumped I found this one though. Good for you. Good for you. Finding gold and garnets. So Scott was just telling us that he found um was this from today? No, this is from a couple weeks ago. Oh, uh, that's mercury. That must be wrapped around gold. There right? is some gold in there, but most of that's pretty raw because see how it just, it's pretty fluid. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, pretty much raw mercury. That's not a natural, right? People were using that to yeah, collect Yeah, because gold. It, it binds so well with gold, they used to, I don't know if they dumped it right in the brook or they used it in their sluice boxes, but. Yeah. Yeah, it would stick to the gold and and it would form these balls and then they'd just take it out and I guess burn it off. Right, yep. Super healthy. Yeah, really good for you. <laughs> good for the brook too. Pretty interesting. But that's some of the stuff that we take out of here when we're panning. Yeah, does some good for sure. Dun, da, da, da. I mean, it's not crazy, but it's oh, nice. maybe the most you can see him from way back there. Yeah. Dun, da, da, da. That's awesome. Bum, bum. Oh, God. Look, I can pick it up with my finger. Yeah, it's huge. <laughs> there she is. Hopefully, I don't drop it like I dropped my garnet. <laughs> Beauty. All right, let's do a quick wrap up of my uh, my haul of the day. So here's my little garnets that I was so excited about. A couple nice pieces there. You got yours, Eddie? I certainly have had worse days on the river than that. I am uh, pretty excited about that, guys. All right. Don't you want to show us yours, Eddie? Trip. Yeah. Jeez. Why don't you get that big piece out? Which Can one? You need to find like the biggest it. piece. Oh, there it is. You can see it. See it right there. That's the one piece right there. Wow. That looks awesome, Eddie. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. Congratulations. That was like my first flake too. I was like, this, this isn't. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't it, is it? Awesome. All right, well, we got a little break in the rain, uh, and we're... Oh, you have something in your pan, Eddie? I do, yeah. I just got another flick. I wouldn't have found it without Scott's advice. Nice. Point it out for us. Twice. Nice yeah. piece. Uh, and on that note, we got a little break in the rain, uh, so we're going to call it a day. Thank you so much again, Scott, for inviting us oh, and love to have you. Uh, letting us dig out of that hole that you guys have been working on. Um, it's been very worthwhile. It has. It's an amazing thing we're having. Oh, we have a great time. And uh, now we have a very long, wet hike out of here <laughs> and drive all the way home. Uh, but we had a ton of fun and hopefully this won't be the last time this summer. Maybe we'll swing up again. Oh, I hope so. Find some more garnets. Nice yeah. <laughs> we'll do another brook that has more garnets in it next ah. time maybe all right well hey folks i hope you enjoyed that thanks again for watching and uh see you next time see you next time